Good morning everyone from Seattle. Just like that, we're back at Formula Drift for mixed round. This year, this year is going by so fast. Evergreen Speedway is probably one of my favorite tracks for sure in Formula Drift. Definitely top two. I think Long Beach was first and then maybe here. So I'm really happy to be back. Last year we had our first podium in the Mustang at this track. Really got things into a groove for us. So I'm very excited to be jumping back behind the wheel of this beast once again this weekend. Uh, practice is just about to start. It's an early day for us. So I'm just gonna jump in the car now, quickly watch an onboard from last year uh, because one of the hardest parts of this track is coming off the end of the bank at the right position. So watching an onboard will just help me uh, refresh my memory. And uh, yeah, hopefully we have some good runs today. So let's see how it goes. just wrapped up our first practice session here in Seattle uh, what a track like it's amazing running that bank and uh, what I'm very happy about so far is that we've been managing to do the initiation with no handbrake uh, clutch kicking straight into it so that's feeling really good we're making a few adjustments to the car uh, shortening up the final drive ratio it just feels a little bit long especially for the infield and just to be very neat and tidy and uh, also in our first couple of laps we had a little bit of a misfire and uh, a couple of small details so team are working on that now uh, we we'll try to get it right uh, Ray is putting in a new set of NGK spark plugs making sure everything's good oh uh, Becky having a little team meeting team meeting team meeting fresh Everybody set of NGKs Mr. Scientist I was like, scientist. 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 Yeah, so second session just about to start. We'll get back out there and give it our best.
been a good thing to see. Yeah, fingers crossed here. We're going to get a good, um, I mean, a good visual of what we're looking for. James Dean, current points leader right now, absolutely crushing in practice. So, whoa, lots of angle. Looks like the car checked up. That was that was very strange. I mean, there's the announcer's curse right there. Okay, so just wrapped up practice from our first day. Hasn't been ideal. A lot of silly issues happening in the car. Just not happy at the moment. It's a new motor that we put in for the last part of the season and we just have temperamental misfires where it's on cylinders, off cylinders, on cylinders, off cylinders and also what's worse than that is the clutch. Uh, we have a hydraulic issue in the clutch where the clutch is sticking to the floor, the pedal sticks down for like three or four seconds and then comes back to the top on its own accord. So we have a hydraulic issue for sure. Uh, it's really frustrating because I almost had two crashes caused because of the clutch sticking to the floor and losing drive. So I'm glad it didn't happen. So just one of those days, you know, things have been going great recently. The cars have all been perfect and performing back-to-back -back laps, but here we are back in motorsport and it's testing us. So uh, it's just frustrating when it goes like this, even when it has been going really smoothly, but this is motorsport, this is what we signed up to. We just have to try to learn from it, and uh, you know, we need to try to learn from it, see what's going on, see why she's not so happy with me today, and uh, get back on track tomorrow, hopefully we'll have figured out. So, poor team have a bit of work to do tonight. Just a bit. A That's a bit. bit. That's a bit. So it's it's not ideal, but it could be worse, All right? Right. Yeah, All right. Good morning, everyone. It's game day here, Formula Drift, Seattle. Team have the car first in line for practice, way up the top here, and yeah, I'm hoping that they've got everything figured out. They worked really hard last night uh, trying to figure out what went wrong with the clutch setup yesterday. Uh, they think they found some things, so. Um, hopefully today we're on for a smoother run, uh, we can get as many practice laps as possible, battling for us, Wang first and top 32. Let's just uh, give it our best, hope that we have a, a good day and uh, try to enjoy it. So let's take it one lap at a time and see how it goes, fingers crossed. done and we have two problems clutch issues and so I'm basically not getting any you'll see from the onboard I can't shift because the clutch isn't fully clearing so there's load in the transmission with the tires spinning and it won't shift to the next gear so that's uh, frustrating I did a chase run as well and every time I was on the handbrake behind Higa it was a sick chase run but every time I was on the handbrake it was killing the engine. Yeah, we have to totally change clutch setup. Um, this is weird because this is the clutch we've been using the last five rounds without any issues whatsoever. But it's just something, something somewhere that's uh, causing us a big issue. Uh, so it looks like I'm going to be missing a lot of practice today. I don't. Yeah, I think my next run will be top 32 against Horace Wang. 
So uh, it's not ideal, but look, this is motor sport. I just need to rest my energy as much as I can, and uh, let's see what the day brings. So it's not ideal, but we've been having a great run. Also, the steering rack started leaking fluid, so the car is just uh, just doesn't wanna doesn't wanna fly today. But the team are working hard. We won't give up. I got faith that we can pull some magic out of the bag. Um, so yeah, it's disappointing, but it's motorsport, and uh, just need to get out, have a rest, and uh, yeah, fingers crossed we can get it right for top three soon. Great dude, his 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 Betty Becky is here in the building. But James Dean, get a get a fast pass to the top 16, chilling, grilling, thrilling. Let's lay out. Listen to the AutoZone Mustang RTR Spec 5 FD. Send it. In the top 16, unfortunately Forrest had an issue with his engine and couldn't run the battle so we had a boy run. We still took it, I didn't know if everything was going to work because it hasn't been all day. Uh, but super happy to get that boy run in. Top 16, I'm just super happy and super proud of the team for not giving up. The amount of work they had to do so far this weekend is just crazy. And uh, yeah, we're taking it. How do you feel? I feel like there's really not much more we can change on this car. <laughs> except the driver, but he's all right. <laughs> Good job. Oh, you do. Are you exhausted? No. <laughs> we got adrenaline. Yeah. Practice. Yeah. Mechanics practice. Yeah. On the real. Thank you again, man. Yeah, man. Thank, Thank you, buddy. Yeah. A lot of work. So they changed the whole subframe. Uh, put the setup in the new subframe that we're running on the old subframe. Made sure the gear was right, like everything, uh, just before our top 32 run. And the most important thing to me is that, you know, we're into the top 16, we got good points, and uh, now we can just take it one lap at a time. So, fingers crossed the car has done its temperamental for the weekend, and we can focus on what we need to do. Overcooked it, has not seen a head-to-head -head battle.
at him. He's bu he's pushing Jones around, but if Jones just keeps it right, he oh buddy. He oh wow, what an amazing initiation! Oh doctor, look at that. Jones taking down a three-time champion. Maybe one more outside zone for Jones. James Diaz, Jeff Jones, amazingly throws down a heater lead run. Yeah, that's oh. right. The place a run. What a disaster! After all the effort and all the effort the team put in. I absolutely threw it away. I was on a killer lead run, uh, came up at the end of the bank, tapped the wall, it kind of pulled the front and that tap was enough to put me offline. I dropped three tires, had an incomplete, then I knew I needed to chase super hard and I chased them as hard as I possibly could. Uh, on the last transition I was blind in the smoke with the sunlight coming behind the grandstand. Hit them hard on the transition, I should have drove smarter. But look, it is what it is. It's just one of those weekends where we haven't got much practice. The car's been giving us trouble. I kind of lost a bit of confidence in the car and just, you know, not knowing that I could be repeatable. So uh, I tried to go 100% when I counted and I went too far. So wish we learned this earlier. It's the first time I went three wheels off all weekend, um, but it is what it is. It is what it is. I'm sick and I'm gutted. I knew this is my favorite track. It's the first time I haven't been on the podium here. So I threw it away, but it's motorsport. Right, time for a well-earned break. No drifting next weekend. Just gonna go away and uh, settle down and relax. And we'll come back strong.
so that was a really worthwhile test. Um, I think we figured everything out. The car felt great. The clutch was working perfectly. Gear shifts are smooth. Uh, everything that we needed just a day late. So a bit unfortunate, but could be a lot worse. Um, I'm really, really glad we got this last minute test. It wasn't even planned. I just came to the track. The guys are working here. And I said, guys, maybe we just try to run it. And uh, they put the new setup in there, made a few changes, ran a few hard laps back to back, pushing the limits and it felt great. So, not a bad way to wrap up the video. Uh, now myself and Becky are going on vacation. <laughs> <laughs>